Today we're going to look at balancing chemical equations using the chemical equation for water. Begin with the hydrogen molecule, which is a diatomic molecule having two atoms of hydrogen. We also have a diatomic oxygen molecule having two atoms of oxygen. Our equation begins with the diatomic hydrogen and the diatomic oxygen becoming H2 plus O2. Hydrogen and oxygen will reconfigure into a molecule of water, having two atoms of hydrogen, one atom of oxygen, to make H2O. We now have our base equation, H2 plus O2 yields H2O. But this is not a balanced equation. As you see, there are two hydrogens on the left, and two hydrogens on the right, but on the left you have two oxygens and only one oxygen on the right. This is an unbalanced equation. To begin balancing this equation, we will add a second water molecule to the right hand side. By placing a 2 coefficient in front of the H2O, we have two molecules of H2O. This corrects for the oxygen, which now gives us two oxygen atoms on the right to match the two oxygen atoms on the left, but the hydrogen now has four on the right and only two on the left, so we must continue in the process of balancing the equation. We can do this by adding a second molecule of hydrogen on the left. This would give us four hydrogen atoms on the left, four atoms of hydrogen on the right, two atoms of oxygen on the left, and two atoms of oxygen on the right, we now have a balanced equation. 2H2 plus O2 yields two molecules of H2O. When we check our atom counts, we now have four hydrogen on the left and four hydrogen on the right, two oxygen on the left, and two oxygen on the right. We now have a balanced chemical equation. So the final balanced chemical equation for water is 2H2 plus O2 yields 2H2O. And remember, chemistry is all that matters.